Hi friends, welcome to Sada Learning Hub. You are with me, Sada Shivarao. Today's session, we are going to learn the most important Java interview questions. The first question is, what restrictions are placed on the location of package statements within a source code file? A package statement must appear as a first line in the source code file excluding blank lines and comments see here whenever you are creating a class the package statement is a first line of your of your source code file otherwise it gives a compile time error it excluding blank lines and comments the package st package statement is the first statement of your file java class the next question is do i need to import java.lang package anytime why no it is by default loaded internally by the jvm we no need to import it our java.lang package into your java class by default java.lang package is imported into your java class the next question is can i import same packages or classes twice will the jvm loads the packages twice at runtime one can import the same package or a same class multiple times neither compiler nor jvm complains about it but the jvm will internally loads the classes only once no matter how many times you import the same class see here i am importing the date class in the two times once a one can import the same package or the same class multiple times it's possible we can import it it's not at all a problem but jvm will internally loads the class only once it doesn't loads in two times it loads only once the next question is does importing a package imports its sub packages as well in java in java when a package is imported its sub packages are not imported and the developer need to import them separately if required for example if a developer imports a package university dot star all classes in the all the classes in the package name university are located but no classes from the sub packages are loaded to load the classes from the sub packages developer has to import its explicitly as follows import university dot department dot star we need to import the sub packages separately it uh, is not possible to uh, import the base classes it doesn't import the base classes as well as sub packages we need to ma uh, separate we need to mention separately for the import statements and uh, base packages and the import statements for the packages and sub packages the next question is what are the various access specifiers for the java class there are the different various access specifiers uh, four access specifiers are available the first one is public protected default and private now i can discuss the some points regarding this access specifiers from the same class public is visible and protected is also visible and default is also visible and private is also visible in the same class those are all visible and coming to from any class in the same package public protected default or visible but private is not visible private classes is not visible for su su separate packages some other packages from a subclass in the same package public is available protected and default is both three are visible but private is not visible from subclasses outside the same package yes public is visible and uh, protected is visible through the inheritance default and private 
those are not visible from any non sub classes outside the package only public classes visible and the remaining specifiers protected default private those are not visible in java access specifiers are the key keywords used before a class name which is define the access scopes the type of access specifiers are the classes are public protected default and private public is class uh, it can be used for class level method level field level and uh, it accessible anywhere and coming to the protected it's a method method field can be accessed from the same class to which they belongs or from a sub classes and from the class of a same package but not for outside default method field classes can be accessed only from the same packages and not from outside of its native packages and coming to the private method field can be accessed from the same class to which they belongs the next question is can a class be declared as protected the protected access modifier cannot be applied to a class and the interfaces methods fields can be declared as protected however methods and the fields in the interface cannot be declared as a protected if you see the protected access specifier it can be applied only for methods and the fields and the, it only applied in the class methods and fields it's not possible to protected in the interface methods and fields it's only possible to apply the protected access specifiers in the class uh, class contains methods and fields levels the next question is what is the access scope of a protected method protected method can be accessed by the classes within the same package or by the sub, sub packages of the class in any packages protected method can be accessed by the class within the same packages or by the sub packages of the class in any packages the next question is can we define the private and protected modifiers for a variables in interface no it's not possible if you see here i'm creating a one interface that is the test interface in this test interface i'm creating a private variable one protected variable one it's not possible no private modifier for, uh, no private modifiers for the variables in the interface and no protected modifiers for variables in the interface it's not possible to declare the variables inside a interface as private and protected thank you so much watching this video hope this lesson helpful to you keep watching our lessons keep writing to us do not forget subscribe our channel sadot learning hub because we have many session that would help you to develop our skills and i will be back soon till then you take care bye bye